how to have smarter inspiration. I'm out here at a gorgeous library and there's a little pond and some fun ducks and stuff around. Oh, the baby chicks are over there, really cool. I wanted to share with you um, some ways to be have a smarter inspiration when you are in sales. I'm reading this book, Sales by Jim Williamson. And he starts off with some great quotes. This one's by Les Wolf. It is better to have philosophy to outthink your competition than to outspend them. I think this is my favorite story. Okay, so I want to read it, and then I want to share you some insights and maybe an experience that I've had from it. When you're in sales, it's always comforting to have an advertising and promotional budget behind you, right? But when you're small and you're smaller and your dollars are short, I always recommend piggybacking on your competitor's budget. I see this principle in action every day, but one of the best examples was provided by the innovative owner of Little Hamburger Stand deep in the Bain of National Forest. As you drive along the scenic stretch of the Canadian Highway, you will notice a large sign that boldly proclaims the world's greatest hamburgers 100 miles ahead. A little farther down the road, another sign written up 50, oh my goodness, this duck's gonna get me. <laughs> 50 major magazines, world's greatest hamburgers, 95 miles ahead. These signs continue in one form or another with obvious expense of every few miles for the entire 100 mile journey. By the time it finally arrived, everyone in our car was definitely ready for that burger. As you might expect, the parking lot at the hamburger stand was overflowing with people who had the same idea. As I continued around the next bend, however, this is the point where there stood a second hamburger stand, the only advertising expenditure in, of this particular establishment was a single sign that read, world's second greatest hamburgers, and it turns out to is perpetually crowded with the overflow from its famous competitor. If you're number two, think like Avis. <laughs> you know that car company? Ask yourself, which competitor is attracting prospects by outspending me? Where is the overflow? How can I position myself the same intersection with those prospects? So the lesson you learn here is know your competition. <laughs> to try going with, not against, your competition. Let your lead competitors draft for you. So to share this experience, I've seen some wonderful marketers try to rank on Google with the same keyword. You know, being an SEO, you gotta learn how to rank your, outsmart your competition. Well, these two were competitors for years and they knew who each other were and they were never, you know, work with each other. But they finally came together, came forces, and worked together, and now their business is exploding even more. And it's amazing to see, I won't name who they were, I've just there's been a, several that do that. <laughs> there's been several um, competitors like that that um, have been working together like that in the video marketing space and, you know, um, internet marketing, there's a lot of competition and when you are know how to rank stuff, um, you'll, you'll find them real fast and you want to see what they're doing. You try to um, follow their processes and see how you can outdo them. So this was a, a very enlightening story where in almost industry, now I pretty much and go directly and see who the competitor is and follow all their followers and just be in that crowd and and really see how we can work together and growing the same community because that's really where it is we're talking and having relationships with the same people who want burgers right <laughs> so i want oh here's the babies let's see if i can show right over there baby little duckies see them let's see if i can oh no they're over there there they are <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful day out here. This is Cinco Ranch Library out here in Houston, Texas. Thanks for watching and I'd love to hear how you have worked together with your competitors and made it prosper even more. Have a great day. Bye guys.